All right, so in this um, little exercise, I'm going to show you, uh, there's a panorama back here, uh, pretending up on high in a tower at the uh, World's Fair in 1904. And if I had a camera up here in the tower, I wanted to zoom in on the various sections um, and then overlap these images in um, our um, stitching software. What I would do is, first of all, um, zoom in on, let's say, this section here. And then I would overlap, if I'm going to the right, by about that much. And I take, so I take that picture and I'd make sure then I was pointing camera, I'd overlap by one third like that. And then I'd overlap the next image like that. And then I would go back to my first column and I would have to try to remember uh, where I actually overlapped. Okay, so I'm gonna this back over uh, and it's better to underestimate overestimate how much you have to overlap i would say maybe about there and then the next one would be here and so on and then when you come back and you do the next column you have to overlap again coming down and you're overlapping now the previous column and now you're overlapping coming down as well so you You'd be doing that all the way across, overlapping the previous column and then the rows as you come down. That's the way you would create yourself a good overlapping image, a bunch of overlapping images that you could then um, stitch together. 